Hey there, everyone. This is Al Cow playing uh, uh, E-Reader Rampage. Uh, we're on the like we just, last time we finished the third page. We only have one page left. It doesn't doesn't it seem weird that I'm a little saddened by that? Because I feel like yesterday. I feel like we're starting to see a lot of improvements from this from this author. Like he's actually genuinely getting like a bit better. Like things like I feel like there's more flow to the levels. Like the there I don't know. There's a coherency to them. Uh, there's nice little setups. But all this is happening while our eyes are right on the finishing line here. Eight levels left. Recently, I've been doing four a pop, so we'll see if we'll continue that. Well, like, uh, so we could be done two days, but also any of these could end up being a one-level video. Atlantis planes, uh, more planes with all the collectible types. So, Dagadons and E. Okay, so in spite of the palette and the moving background, we are playing regular Mario. Got it. This is what I need. And this great. Oh, uh, that guy's gonna jump up at some point, right? Second, I'm not ready for it. I'm just gonna do that. It's fine. It's fine. Maybe red block or scary. Cause they keep being pretty. That's a state. That's why I need it. I'm gonna go in this pipe. Go in every pipe, man. Go in every pipe. Welcome to the place with the squids. Oh, whoops. Well, I swam into you. Okay, well, I could not see you there, uh, Delectrode. I appreciate that it's like, whoa, this, what is, okay. Do not leave the water. It makes the controls, like, freak out. But, okay. Yeah, like, like, see, like, like, there was no way to see those Delectrodes. Like, they were there. They existed in a state where it was just gonna happen. Oh, no. Wait a second. I think I can just re-enter this pipe, right? And then get, like, a fireball? Yes, I can. Well, assuming I can survive the onslaught of these guys. So, so not free, but knowing they're there helps so... Okay, you know what? You get, like, insane momentum underwater. I think... I think... I, I can probably do it. I can probably farm a fireball, but I just don't think that practically it's going to happen. I need a thing to throw down that pit, hit this pit here. Do you happen to have a turtle shell nearby? I can use to do. That's great! Just what I needed. Uh, uh, shoot. Well, okay, you guys are kind of annoying. Yeah, that's number three. Is there another easier to get turtle shell? around here there is in fact oh, okay there we go also i got a magical fireball if you're into that i am it turns out all right don't lose the shell though you did exactly what i didn't want you to do you know that okay but if i do this some of these will be back okay okay all right so don't wake up on me please I'm just gonna do that and miss. Beautiful. Interesting how you're not falling in the pit, though? How do you get that? <laughs> okay, so... Throw more up instead. Got it. But by doing so, I have forever corrupted the camera. Then it got fixed. It's all good. Don't worry about it. You can go in this pipe. It's a pipe. Hey, check it out. We hid the e-coin. Very good. Bart Simpson is here in the neighborhood. Great. <laughs> Fantastic. Love it. Uh, oh, you're gonna have to fire. Yep. And that's when I die forever.
Thank you very much. Well, don't thank me. Alright, so... Are these plants, like, killable with fire? They are! Well, this suddenly becomes significantly easier. Get out of here. I'll take that one up. Alright, anything on top? Anything on top? Nothing on top! This is yet another structure where I guess the expected, uh, uh, like, resolution is to just rush through it, I guess. Right. Whoa, go in this pipe, though! Whoa, check it up. Another swimming segment. There's fish everywhere. And money. Yeah, that money end up somewhere else. Come back out from the same pipe you came in. Wow! Whoa there, buddy! Alright! Everything is blue! I don't know why! <laughs> the game was not ready to be in semi-underwater state. Ah, uh, it didn't save that coin, and it didn't save that coin. And now it says six out of nine. I've got six. That's what matters. I, I know I got the coin. We saw Bart Simpson. Icy fields. There we go. We, we got we got A coins again. Coins of A. So the yeah, it's ice level. Shocking. So the fun part about playing this though is that people in the community, some people have been looking at Smaghetti and like trying to get see what's going on. And it sounds like Bumpy. It sounds like Bumpy. Sounds like some of the problem that this level pack experienced, this pack, uh, are more than likely due entirely, uh, whoa, nice, uh, because of the editor itself. Like, 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 apparently, apparently, the editor does a lot of brute forcing. There's clearly, like, some things that the editor itself just kinda happily decides for you and uh you know i'm sure that it's just like the easiest way to make it happen but yeah like for example the original uh you know Super mario advance 4 has a bunch of camera control objects that are also used in the e-reader levels but which is automated by Smaghetti. So, you know, turns out that might not be super- Oh wow, you are just fast! Slow down, McFlurry, it's okay, it's fine. You don't have to be that way, but I appreciate that you are. But yeah, but still, like, that to me does not excuse the fact that the level very often feels like it was not actually played. I don't know if it was, like, played in editor, like, I don't know if that's a thing. I mean, it's a thing in Lunar Magic. But, like, Smaghetti is, like, is not even, like, a thing you download. It's, a, uh, it's, like, an in, uh, browser editor on the internet. That's why- can I do that, Joe? I mean, I can do it from here, I'm reasonably sure. Reasonable! Yeah, that's right, I had a fireball and I used it. Oh, boy. Uh, ground here? Okay. You never know. land. I don't know. You will never know. Welcome to the ice and plastic block. It's like I'm playing smooth. Although, so you can have tall guy. Oh, and that one is just tall. Also, no sliding on this. Uh, timing here isn't great. But we'll do... You switched! Okay, I got got. Like, I saw that other one was vertical only, so I was like, okay. Yeah, this is a lot harder if you can't just burn all your enemies. Dude. Well, anyway, I needed a fireball to get one coin, so I would have, yeah. Yeah, Okay. I believe that in the real Super Mario 3, if you get- if you release a power-up, then you get shrunk and you touch the power-up. I forget how Mario 3 reacts. 
Because Smoo will just give you the power up, even if you're small. And I know if you use a map item in Mario 3, you can do that. But I'm not sure, like, if you're, like, in the universe. Because in Mario, the first one, like, in Mario 1, if you are big, you release a fire flower, get hit, and then touch the fire flower, then you are just brought back to big. And so that's just kind of been my assumption, that that's just, like, how, how it always works in NES games like this. But I do not know that for a fact. Where did I die? Right. I died over here, doing a thing. Yeah, this guy here. Ah, uh, see, here I could clearly see it goes out horizontally as well as vertically. Alright, just don't assume things. Ah, I can see the last uh, acorn. It's down here. It's down in this pit. It's just down here. The most fantabulous pit the world has ever seen. Can you really do that jump? Okay. Mario 3 Mario is a jumper. Alright, I think there's land here, right? Okay, yeah, it's dangerous. Can you burn a Bumpty? That feels wrong. I don't like that you can burn a Bumpty. I, I don't know. I, I'm gonna complain on Nintendo about that one. I That feels wrong. I, I don't like that. I feel like Bumpty should be nigh invincible. Like, that's how they are in Yoshi Island. That's why they're so effective. It's because you can't do anything to a, a little pumpkin that's a penguin. Orange house. Is that why I said pumpkin? Dodge spikes. That one I remember playing. This is like the one game of these. Like, I forgot about Dig. I forgot. Wow, great start. Just fantastic gameplay. I forgot about the digging one. I forgot about the other one that I still have forgot. But I remember that one. So if you want me actually clearing these games, go watch my original run of the e reader real levels. Pyramine Day! Not Pyramid. Pyra mind. Mind your Pyra. <laughs> well, there's the pyramid. Alright, so, just a door in the middle of nowhere. Uh -huh. Whoa, buddy. Whoa. Okay, well, so now I'm curious about the door to nothing, so I'm just gonna go in it. Check it out, it's money! In a bonus room. Pop these blocks. Become a clown. I don't need to do that last part. Alright, well. Knowing that this is just like, uh, check it out, I found these sprites, I'm gonna put them here. It's hot dog, you can burn a hot dog? Really? I don't think I knew that. I also just assumed those are fireproof. I feel like I don't use fireballs often in the real game. Oh shoot, where's land? Like here I can clearly see, land is here, I'm just gonna do light taps. See here, it's a pit. Okay, but, okay, there I saw land at the very edge. Oh, that's just mean. Yeah, I can't see you're not glittering there. Stomp phase, zone face. Okay, I figured, look, if you're gonna put a tree, it's probably gonna be safe. I don't know, though. Just going to assume there's a brick and then another kind of block and there's a bomb. Yeah, alright, well, I'm not getting those clearly. Little cactus balls underneath the blocks. And that level just kind of does. There are levels in this pack, though, that are just this. It's just, yeah, I don't know. Go. You got it. You got it, buddy. You got it. All right, beach bounty. Here we go. To the beach. Once again, E and A's. E A sport. Goomba, like, right in your face. It's a beach. You can tell because there's water. Alright, sweet. Uh, I can't do a basic jump. Yeah, ball! I don't remember that. The ball on the water is what I need, I guess. Okay. Whoa, this feels kind of bad, but... Alright, okay, so there we go. Now it's going. This also is a Yoshi Island thing. I mean, so, like, I understand. Like, one of the Mario Advance game was a Yoshi Island game, right? I'm guessing all the Advance Mario games were on the same engine, and so... Porting things from game to game is probably relatively trivial. These are the assumptions I made. Wow. What a cool guy that makes me. <laughs> what is wrong with me? Uh, whoa there, buddy. Watch out. Alright, we're gonna go in pipes. Whoa. Go and uh, try to go. But instead, you moved. Yeah, we did it. Video games. 
do I want to jump on a turtle? To get to a far or high place. Doesn't look like it. Okay. At some point, I just kind of lose control. And I just kind of fall off the ball. But it doesn't matter that much. Although, I will miss the fireball. I'm going to go ahead and say it. Having the ability to just set a fish on fire is a very useful one. I guess you don't need to let it go full speed ahead. But that just feels so much better. So it is going to happen. I'm sorry. Alright, fireball. In impressive. Hi, it's a dolphin. Wow, amazing. That's a guy walking. Wow, amazing. Another dolphin. Impossible to imagine. I want to see the ground again. Here's the last A. It's very well hidden. Can I even like not get it? Can you, can you dodge it? Like I don't know if the ball could like crush you or something. It'd be something. And here's the E. Oh, that's the most well-hidden E in the game. Thank you very much. I don't know what that image was. <laughs> I, is that a Splatoon girl? Like the pink one? I don't know her name. It kind of looked like her, maybe? Maybe. That one, the E meter works, so that's good. Okay. Yeah. Next time seems to be hinting at kind of a Sky World kind of thing. Maybe we beat the game tomorrow. It could happen. Maybe one of the levels gonna be real hard too. Like I said, like we've experienced it today. There's not really a difficulty curve of any recognizable fashion. 